Hello there. Grandma decided to start a motel business. Okay, hold on, wait. <laughs> I'm just practicing my voice. Ow. Hi, everybody. Hey, Grandma Bread here. I need to stop with this. So welcome back. In today's video, I decided we're going to be building a very sketchy and uh, trashy abandoned... Well, not really abandoned. Okay, it's going to be in business. I think this is the last thing I'm going to do with this new update stuff. It's been a week, right? It's been one week. I'm going to be making a motel. Motel is pretty much just a cheaper version of a hotel, if you don't know what a motel is. Um, and you hear all sorts of scary stories about motels rather than some hotels. Um, and it's a little smaller, and I don't want to build something huge, so yeah. Okay, so here is kind of like an example of a motel. So um, as you can see, you can actually enter these rooms from outside of the building. Um, that's the difference between hotels and motels. And they're like motorized, I guess. They're kind of just more accessible, I guess. I have no idea. But hotels, you enter your rooms inside the building. But this is like outside the building because it's just direct. Um, this is just a lot of examples. They're very blocky. And I'm sure there's some really nice, you know, high quality motels out there. <laughs> okay, let's get started, shall we? I'm going to dress up as grandma while I'm building, no problem. Sus sketchy <laughs> motel. I don't know why I thought the sus was going to get like censored or something. Suspicious. I don't know how I really want this to go. I have done a motel before. I think many, many years ago. Five years ago. Oh gosh, I found the video too. This is what my motel looked like. Oh gosh, so that's what my... This was from like five years ago. Wow, I made it all blue and it was made out of concrete. Each room was like a different color and it... Oh my goodness, okay. I'm gonna say, I feel like this uh, like sketchy one might look better than the one I actually tried to make look decent five to six years ago. How do I want this to go? I actually want it to look kind of decent when you're actually like entering. I want to make it look realist. Maybe we'll have like, we'll start over here and then we'll like, we'll do something like, I could always change it. This is a placeholder guys, do not worry. If you think it looks really bad, um, it's on purpose. I just want to measure. I just want to measure out my plot. Okay, don't mind this. Ignore this entire thing. I just need it to like actually... <laughs> okay, look, if it's a sketchy motel, it's gotta look bad, right? It's it's fine. No problems. It's on brand if it actually looks terrible. So let me use my plane markings. If you're ever making a parking lot, just know a two by a three by two, I guess, is like the perfect measurement because that's how big cars are really. Like, look at that. This car is exactly like a it's pretty much a three by two. Um, most cars are like, yeah, look at that. It's perfect. So in case you didn't know, there you go. I guess we'll start like this. Maybe I'll do like um, a valet, a valet, a valet. Uh, it's going to be the fanciest motel ever. Not really. I make it look bad. Okay. Trust me. This is already looking questionable. I'm always overthinking about how bad it's going to look. And then I need just, I need to just tell myself to just do it. We will totally fix this more if, ha if needed, of course. I'm just eyeballing it. It's looking very, it looks like legs now. I'm so done. All right, now let's start building that actual motel. So we're just gonna straight up, uh, I'm gonna do this and then maybe I'll get a few pillars. Get a few pillars. I'm gonna use these plain ones and put them like, we gotta have a staircase going somewhere. Maybe, where does the staircase usually start? Maybe like over here? And then let's get like a traditional fence railing. Okay, I don't know about traditional. How about like a metal, metal fence railing for this? Perfect. Then we will go ahead and quickly add a floor. There we go. Very nice. And then I'll just add this railing here. You know, protection. Protection. I kind of want some of it to be like broken looking though. That'd be kind of fun. Once again, we have to make this look like like very suspicious. It's going to be a giant rectangle. That's all I'm going to say. There's nothing going to be like super special about this. It's just rectangular. Um, let's use like concrete, I guess. We'll, we'll continue the tradition of the concrete sort of thing later. We'll get to the like scary details later. How shall we divide these rooms up? Let's, let's go and do that first before we close up this building. All right, I think each motel room should be like pretty relatively small. You just gotta have a bed, maybe a TV dresser and a bathroom. That's all you need. Walk like sort of thing here. Why not? Oh, that helps a lot actually make this look a little bit accessible. If you need to like actually walk to this place, um, try not to get hit by cars. Yeah, perfect. That is so ugly. And I just add, add this to it. There you go, much better. Okay, that looks so... <laughs> that looks weird. I hope one day we're allowed to like edit these things. I'm just gonna leave it. Don't don't mind it. <gasps> I forgot to raise it. I'm so done. Okay, I'm giving up on that one for now. <sighs> okay, there should be like a really 
weird sign here too. Like I'm thinking a sign like right here. We can have a few like trees and stuff. I, I'm flip-flopping way too much, but I must. But I'm already imagining a sign right here. Like very safe, ho very, very non-suspicious motel, you know, like a sign right here. And then I'm going to have like plants and whatnot all over this, like boom. Kind of giving me tombstone vibes. I don't know why. I didn't even do that much yet, but it's yeah, something like that. Put some detailing on this thing, you know, just like maybe gray. I feel like gray is more eerie for like an outline. I'm just all about the details now. I'm just going to add the details to this thing. Thank goodness for this transform tool. I am so grateful. So grateful for this transform tool. Hey, okay, wait, how am I dividing these rooms? Okay, five by four rooms and then two of them can be like four by three. Slightly smaller, but they're still like the same length they're just not as wide i guess i'll do that for this too to make it like we have a total of eight rooms here you know eight rooms pretty good um i really don't want to do the, anything else on this side i think usually over here is where like the actual owner or something like the manager kind of business stuff i don't know i actually i've never been to a motel illuminated circular post <gasps> Wait, this is perfect for a motel, I think. This just screams motel. Okay. Sorry, sorry, I'm getting distracted again. I'm getting distracted. Let's go ahead and add the doors to these. Should I go ahead and use a broken door? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna use these broken doors for the motel rooms just because why not? Uh, we can do like a very special room right there. Yeah, that's very suspicious. And then we do need windows. We do need windows for each motel room as well. Nice, nothing like a good window this is so bad wait maybe for these ones they have the small windows <laughs> oh dear okay wait 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 wait. i have an idea wait wait we gotta flip this we gotta flip this so the door goes here and then the window yeah 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 this looks so bad <laughs> this looks terrible okay and because we're just so high quality each you know door is like not each door but some of these doors have different colors let's do like blue and then a lighter green or maybe just like not even blue but oh man wouldn't you want to like visit this place i know it okay that's gonna bother some people that they're not lined up but that's just part of the product you know it's it's on brand now i just need a flat roof all of this um this looks so bad. <laughs> this looks so bad. But part of me is telling myself, like, that's that's the point, right? It's supposed to look bad. <sighs> Hold on, let me change up the fence. I don't think these metal ones are kind of... They're not They're not good. What about these? Um, I'll use this. I think this would be better. We got something going on. Oh my gosh, what is happening? And then the back, there should be, like, a little... A pool. There should be a pool... Do po motels have pools? I don't know. We're gonna make try and make this look disgusting. I think there's a build hack where you can actually make the water look terrible. And then a fence around all of this. Yes. I don't know if they should have that type of fence. How about like this fence? I'm just gonna bring this down. That's not the right one. This one. Okay, maybe I'll add like a little chimney to this too. You know those um those vent vents? Those um HVAC systems at the very top? Yeah, that's Honestly, wait, it's kind of like, wait, wait, it's like this. It's on a little platform. And then I'll show you guys what HVAC is. <laughs> okay, this is what they kind of look like. They come in a few different sizes, I think, but this is what they generally look like. I'm definitely not doing the detailing. Okay, there's like a fan ventilation thingy on top. I'm actually like doing little custom things now, guys. Wow, okay, that's not even the center. They're like a material that kind of just makes it look like, ooh, wait. Yeah, we can just mess with material. I don't know. I'm just gonna put like a few. I don't think this makes any sense at all. I don't even know what they're connected to, to be honest. Um, and then I'll just I'll put a fog machine coming from out of this. I know it probably is not a good sign if your HVAC is like smoking. Okay, let's go and get some outdoor lamps too for this. I'm gonna use these ones. I wish we had broken lamps. But Maybe I should make it out of wood. Maybe the entire building should be made out of wood. Okay, I kind of like the concrete. We're keeping the concrete. I'm gonna go ahead and add some detailing, I guess, to this place. Let's add like some trash here and there. You know, just some in the parking lot too, you know, just trash everywhere. This place is not very much taken care of. The owner doesn't really care. Maybe some pallets could be randomly placed around. Air dry, someone wants to air dry their clothing right there i think i've done a lot for the exterior it's not bad it's not that bad 
Um, there's one more thing I have to add, which is like the manager. Yes. So let's go and floor up the interior, design all of it. I think I'm just going to copy and paste every single room because that's just how motels are. They're pretty much like copy and pasted things. Um, okay, so here is what the interiors of motels, you know, tend to look like. They, they're, Of course, they're all different. Some actually look pretty decent compared to some others. Like this one's a... Oh yeah, we need bathrooms. Okay, so let me add two by two bathrooms for each of these as well. You know, the beds should be okay. How about like a standard double bed? Thing? Okay, from here on out, I'm just gonna go ahead and fill up these rooms. Like, okay, I'll do one actual room and then I'm just gonna copy and paste to the rest of these other rooms. And then, yeah, we'll be finished. And let's add some table lamps. Ooh, I'm gonna add um this one, the log table lamp. Ariel, how about ooh, uneven stains. And then across we'll have like a dresser and a TV. I wish there was like a broken looking TV. Should I use the old television? Okay, honestly, I'm not taking too much inspiration from that one photo, but or wait, what about the other one? Uh the... this one? A stained uneven stripes. I think that would be a better. Okay, inside the bathroom, we'll just use the, of course, the broken toilet. We'll use this toilet, get this ink cross and of course this nice basic shower and then we can of course add holes in the walls as well for more detailing whoa that's a glitch okay i won't be putting it there oh my gosh wait it it messes up the the walls a lot i think in this little corner i'm gonna add like a little floor lamp and like oh you know what they also need they need just a simple a flat out desk that's kind of like hotel vibes you know you get your bed your little tv dresser closet whatever and then your desk nice wait that's pretty much all i need that's kind of luxurious it's kind of luxurious um and then i'm gonna put one beautiful painting in here yes all right cool wait that's actually a good room yeah so that's how my room set out is set up is going to be just standard stuff you do have everything you need there we go stained toilet paper be careful when using this toilet paper guys just be careful and then i will use that tiny light where's that light a lonely light bulb or this yeah that is pretty much the room here is like a... i'm gonna go ahead and do this for the rest of the other rooms and we pretty much are set yeah every room is now pretty much furnished all the bathrooms and stuff they all look the same you know motel things decide whether or not you want them to look different or not i did change up like you know i made each room have a special colored um bed except for these two hold on, hold on let me this is mold that is mold okay i don't know how but all of them are moldy now. Let's make this a crime scene bedroom. I always thought like, hey, maybe this could be a special bedroom all the way over here by itself pretty much. But I'm going to make it a crime scene. This got really serious for the whole entire bed to be like super red. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll just make it moldy. I'll just put blood on the floor. I'll just put like some blood stains on the ground. Do red dirt pile, but then texture it to like, I don't know, maybe metal. I don't know, blood stains everywhere. Maybe some actual wooden planks and whatnot. It's just like broken floorboards. Um, And I'm gonna put some caution tape, you know? I'm totally, it's not because I'm lazy or anything to, you know, decorate this giant room. No, no, no. Um, I actually wanna add like a giant trash little dumpster here too, maybe like. Here. This is where all the trash can be. Very beautiful. On your way to the pool as well. Just lovely, right? I know. This is weird. Okay, some of these don't show up on the, the chair. Okay. Can I just make it dirt stain? No, the dirt stain don't go on it either. Okay, what's the worst texture I can put on this thing then? That's weird. Just do this. Yep. Wow, this looks really scary at night. Not gonna lie. Oh my, that is super scary. Maybe I'll have some like street lights. I don't know if they're called. Let's do the office now. The office, I'm probably not gonna do too much with this. I'll just add like a simple desk or something in here. Not even a nice chair. We'll just do the comfort chair. And then I'll have like, you know, uh, or something over here. Maybe like a waiting area. <laughs> I don't know what kind of waiting area. We'll just do the couches facing each other and then put like a broken coffee table in between them. This is like scary. This is some like scary story game you know like level right here behind the desk i'll add the cinder block book cases all right that's really all i need to do for the little office okay so here is my um sus sketchy motel it is a motel honestly you can tell you can tell what it oh wait what whoa 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 whoa, whoa. i'm surprised i did not color that one moment sorry wait that's glitched for now I, i'm not gonna make a custom sign we'll just call it the we're just gonna 
pick a ram sign motel sign oh wow that's just beautiful okay i'm gonna put it over here as well maybe um maybe i could do like a video like gr do a grand opening of this or something and then i could have people be like you know back in and whatnot okay guys welcome to granny's motel um it is owned by me i spent all my money for this and yeah okay <laughs> All the rooms are going to be the same. I'm not going to go through every single one of them, obviously. So, the first room. We're just going to go through the room I first, like, I started, you know. Okay, I actually forgot to add more holes in the walls for the other rooms, but that's okay. But this is the much a room here in the motel if you decide to check in. This is what you're going to get, pretty much. You do have your bed and your end tables. You got your dresser, your TV, a desk, and your bathroom. Look at this. Wouldn't you want to stay here? They can't afford mirrors, so they never... Um, but yeah, as you can see, every whoa, every room is the exact same. I don't really need to show you every single one. Kind of just like walk past each one. And over here is the crime scene one. Um, it's the abandoned one. Okay, the spirit of whoever is living in this, and we caution taped it off. You know, boom. All right, I'm gonna jump off the balcony here. Over here is the actual office where you need to check into. This is where you check into your motel. You gotta go to this person in charge right here. Like, okay, you're in room, blah, 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 blah. Actually, I should have added room numbers. Um, while people are waiting, they can also sit here on the couch and whatnot. If you like, you can use our complimentary amenities such as the pool. This is the only amenity we provide you. But yeah, it's a nice pool so beautiful i think it's great it's even secure guys it's got a fence over it okay like we believe in security so we have a fence over this pool so no random person can jump into it unless you go all the way around but the person who's in charge is going to catch you before you can even do that there you go and that's pretty much the motel yeah beautiful we even have an hvac system <laughs> Okay, all right, I'm done. Uh, if you guys would like to see a video of me like opening this up in like public servers or doing a grand opening, let me know in the comments and I will see if something up. Yeah, something like that. All right, that's all. Have a nice day. Ah, I fell.